Hello, this video is about YouTube and uploading videos and some of the options we have. So youtube.com, this icon is for creating a video and we want to upload one that we've currently made that's on our desktop. Let's grab, let's see if I can grab this one. So it's over here doing its thing, uploading its video. This is where I will, um, sorry, this is where I will title it, whatever I want to title, description, but that's optional. Thumbnails, uh, YouTube will pick the thumbnail that they think is best. Basically, it's, it's generating them right now. Um, but you can also upload a thumbnail yourself. Sometimes I'll go into Google Slides, put the information I want and make a screenshot of it and just Kind of looks better it's an extra step but um, i think it's a more finished product if you have a playlist you can add it to a specific playlist here this is new it's pretty recent so as strange as it seems we want to say no it's not made for kids because if it is made for kids there's like huge leaps and bounds we have to go over um so that's my suggestion there um and we're going to hit the next button this is the video elements like cards and end of screen stuff. So we're, that's a little advanced for this video. So here's uh, here are your options as far as uh, saving your video. So if it's private, only you and specific people that you put in their email to can see. So it's almost like Google Docs when you say like specific people versus whatever. So this would be private. So you'd, of course, be able to see it. Unlisted is like an unlisted phone number. So unlisted, um, think of it as it's on a piece of paper and I can hand it to Christina and now she'll know my unlisted number. It, it, you can't search for it. But it doesn't stop Christina from handing it off to other people. But again, it's not global. It's not public. So public is you can search it in YouTube and people can find it. Okay, so I am gonna hit public for the one that I'm choosing. And let's see, there's one other thing I wanted to talk about. Okay, so let's publish that. Actually, I'm gonna make it private to be honest. Okay. So this takes a few minutes to render. And so here I'm now in like the videos of, um, sorry, the studio, YouTube studio. My videos are here. When I hover over, I get these details that pop up. So it gives me more uh, options when I do this. So it's right over here. I'm going to click more options. So I can say when I recorded it, video location, this stuff is just nice to know. You don't have to do it. I do think it's appropriate to put it in the education category. Now, this is the closed captioning section. So the language I'm speaking in this video is English. Now, closed captioning. You want to say that the content we're putting on has never been on TV. It's all about the legalities, but you know, I'm sure nothing I've done has been on TV. So, um, so once you do this and we save it, YouTube will use its algorithm engine to listen to my words and do closed captioning automatically. So there's no reason to upload subtitles of your own. Uh, you can. It's just a lot of work and an extra step. So um, you don't need to, it's pretty accurate now. Okay, so everything else is pretty much good to go. Allow embedding if you want someone to put your video inside of their uh, website. And if you want people who subscribe to your feed to get a little email saying, Lisa just made a video, go watch it. So those are the other options. So you hit save and your video should be good to go. Okay, hope this helped.